I'm Mary Ellen Kinnett, and I'm the director of Equiheart and Fierce Feminine Fire programs. Today, I want to take you on a guided, behind-the-scenes journey into ceremonial drum making. The reason I'm making this drum today is to make a donation to the Wild Horse Warriors of San Wash Basin in their fundraiser for building the Van Gogh fence along Highway 318 to protect horses and humans from further injuries or death. So I finally got to go on my first trip last summer, June of 2020. I actually went in search of Picasso who had not been seen for almost a year. And instead I met his son, the now infamous Van Gogh. I met Van Gogh on my second day in the basin and I was breathless watching him spar off and I, I just fell in love with him. And I couldn't wait till the next time that I got to go out there to see him again. I followed him for four days. We covered about 350 miles and saw over 300 horses in that time. And every single day I came up close and personal to Van Gogh and his band. I th felt like we made a special connection and we had eye-to-eye -eye contact every single encounter. So again, I couldn't wait to go back the following year and sadly that was not to be because in October of 2020 he was tragically killed on Highway 318 by a trucker and it sent the world in an uproar and Cindy Wright, who administers the program Wild Horse Warriors for the San Wash Basin, started a fundraiser to try to raise over $100,000 to build a fence. And within months, we were halfway there to the goal. So this drum is being made today to honor the spirit of Van Gogh. We're going to make this drum with goat hide. The picture that we're going to have painted is this one here that I took at Lake Draw on that June morning of 2020. I have an artist friend, Jill Christensen LaCroix Jones, and she's going to do the painting. So today we're gonna to walk you through the steps. These are animal hide drums. I make them in a ceremonial way. I've been doing this since 2016 and the drum circles and drum making workshops. We're gonna show you how it's done and we're gonna show you the special spiritual process that goes into making each one of these drums. We call them birthing the drums and you'll see why. So stay with us.